Morning guys, it's Tuesday 15th, how are we doing? I wanted to speak to you about catching the wave. Now, you know when you like hit that smooth bit in life, when you've like, feels like you've caught the wave and you are just like coasting in. You know, you have a little bit of a pivot, but you are riding. Might be chaos all around you, the rest of the waters are choppy and all that sort of stuff, but you are just coasting in and enjoying the view and getting that adrenaline rush. Now, I love surfing. I can't surf very well at all and I barely ever do it. But whenever we go to the coast, I always try and jump on a board and have a go. Because it's fun, because I really enjoy it. But if you speak to anybody that does surf a lot and is really good, it sounds awesome. Because they talk about the tranquility of being out there, you know, sitting across, looking for the perfect wave, catching it, being in control, getting that oneness with the water. But what they don't often tell you is the bit of discomfort that you have to go through to get there. And I don't just mean learning, what I mean is passing the break. So when you go out surfing, you have to pass the break. The break is where the waves roll over as it's getting close to the shore and it's pretty turbulent and they come pretty thick and fast and they knock you on your ass on a regular basis when you're trying to get out there to the bit where you can enjoy it. Now, a few years back, I went down to Nuki with some friends and one of my friends had his son with him. He was about 10 years old. And uh, he wanted to do some surfing. Saw people out there doing surfing. A lot of it, really enjoyed it. So both got boards, heading in. And it took him a long time to pass the break. Because he was small. And because he kept getting knocked back. And the first few times, it completely flipped him on his ass. We all know what it's like. You get flipped on your ass. You get rolled over. You get beaten down. A lot like life. And he was like, ram this. I did not like that. I felt like I was going to drown. I'm, I'm heading back in. Sitting on the sand, watching with that. I'm not bloody interested. It's too goddamn hard. I can't do it. Approach to life. A lot of people do this. They want the thing. They want to be out there catching the waves. They want to be enjoying life. But they don't want to pass the break. Passing the break is tough. It's not impossible, but it's tough. And yes, if you really do it wrong consistently... It could kill you, you know, you could get caught in that, caught in that vortex, it roll you over and roll you over, and that'll be game over. But, if you're persistent, and if you're humble enough to learn a little bit of technique, you can pass the break. You know, if you do get flipped, go down, get away from it, push hard off the floor, and you'll pop up. Most of the time you're not that deep out anyway, so you'll be okay. And then learn a bit of technique, learn how to punch through the wave, learn how to get through it. Then before you know it, you're out there, looking back at the shore, waiting for the big wave, waiting for that bit where you can catch it and go. But if you don't practice that persistence and consistency, you're never gonna get through the break. You're just gonna keep getting rolled over, rolled over, rolled over, thinking that life isn't fair, because you're not persistent enough. You're not taking the feedback. You're not eager to learn. Surfing's fun catching that wave in life when you've done some of the hard work to start with it's still going to be bloody hard work you've been out in the water you've been out in the sea for a few hours it will kick the hell out of you you know with the sea and the sun and the waves and and all that absolutely thrashes you but it's great and when you're catching them waves and when there's the, the chaos is all around you people are tipping over people are getting washed up people are getting blown out and you are coasting on that wave enjoying it, having the adrenaline. That's what life's all about. You've got to push through the break to get there. So be persistent. It's Tuesday. Did you get knocked on your ass yesterday? You try and get through the break and got bowled over? Good. Let's go again. Let's catch that wave. I'll see you tomorrow.